Campus Virtual Scientific Director with Ziva Fertility Centers. When a woman is trying to get pregnant and she's not, and she presents herself at a fertility clinic, a lot of things have to be investigated in her body, in her physiology, her hormones, uh, ultrasonography, everything. But it begins with a very simple history. How long have they been married for? How long have they been trying uh, with unprotected intercourse? All these questions are very important. Have they had previous surgeries? Did they have any pregnancies that resulted in miscarriages? All these give very critical information about what's happening with her body. In addition to, of course, hormones and ultrasonography, etc. Infertility per se is defined as the inability to get pregnant after one year of unprotected sex, the woman is of 30 years or, or younger age. Now, about 80% of couples will get pregnant in that first year. But if the age is advanced, that is, if you're 35 years or over that, you need to try only for six months and have to, if you're trying to get pregnant, take yourself to the doctor who will perform all these battery of tests that I've told you and try to locate the problem which is there. At 40, physiologically also, your eggs are advancing towards depletion. As in, uh, by the time of menopause, all the eggs are finished. So, at 40 and close to 40, this is what is happening in your body. In addition to decrease in the number of eggs, then egg quality also decreases as the chromosomal competence comes down. As in the chromosomal arrangement, there is a lot of chance of having a uh, abnormal child at this age. Therefore, it's uh, very important that if you are above 35, and you've tried for six months, it's better to go for consultation so that the problem can be identified. However, if you want to go for a, a procedure which will give you a faster result, it is called as IVF, in vitro fertilization or intracytoplasmic sperm injection where a single sperm is selected and put into each egg and an embryo is created. Now at this age, as I said, the chromosomal competence of the eggs is not good therefore uh, there is a high chance of having an abnormal child to which uh, there is a solution it is called as pre-implantation genetic testing for aneuploidy as in for testing for uh, abnormality so the embryo is tested for chromosomal competence that is all the chromosomes are good or not and only the good ones are put back into your uterus this improves your chances of pregnancy by another 10 to 15 percent if you are over 40 years old. The number of miscarriages also increases with age. 14% of uh, women who are under the age group of uh, 35 have uh, a chance of miscarriage. About 19% will miscarry if they are in 35 to 37 uh, age group. Above 40, the miscarriage rate is 25%. Therefore, if you're trying to get pregnant, it's better to go for this procedure faster, sooner than later. 25% of pregnancies result in miscarriages if the women are in the age group of 38 to 40 and about 40% of pregnancies result in miscarriages if the woman is over 40. Therefore, it's very critical that you go for this procedure uh, sooner than later. These miscarriages, as I said, are a result of chromosomal abnormalities. So, in addition to going for IVF, at a proper age, especially closer to 40 or later, uh, it's better to also go for something called as pre-implantation genetic testing. If you want to understand more about this procedure, please feel free to contact us. Thank you. A lot of effort has gone into making this video. Please like and subscribe us. Thank you.